Hi, it's Jennifer with Jennifer at Home, and I'm so glad you joined me today to make some super easy zucchini bread. I have been making zucchini bread for many, many years, and I have tried dozens and dozens of recipes, and this one happens to be the easiest and the best one I've ever come across. So I'm so excited to share it with you today. My great, awesome neighbor, Missy, gave me a zucchini from her garden, and I knew just what I was going to make with it. I've gathered up all of the ingredients, which is the most challenging part of the whole recipe. And let me show you everything that goes in it. This is everything we're gonna to need to make the homemade zucchini bread. A quarter cup of sour cream, one cup finely grated zucchini, two cups of flour, one teaspoon cinnamon, one teaspoon baking soda, half teaspoon of baking powder, quarter teaspoon of salt, one half cup of vegetable oil or canola oil, one half cup of white sugar, a half cup of brown sugar, two large eggs, and two teaspoons of vanilla, and a greased pan. Now we'll grate the zucchini in the food processor. Once you've finally grated your zucchini and measured it out into one cup, take a paper towel and just press down and try to get as much moisture out of the zucchini as you can. They have a lot of water and we don't want a lot of water in our recipe. So just take a paper towel and blot it. And get the moisture out. In one bowl we're going to mix our dry ingredients. I have the two cups of flour. I'm going to add the cinnamon, the baking powder and baking soda, and the salt. I'll mix these together with a whisk. In a large bowl, I'm going to mix eggs, the vegetable oil, the vanilla, and the sugars, the brown sugar and the white sugar. Now I'll stir in the sour cream. Now I'll gently Fold in the dry ingredients. The last ingredient, other than chocolate chips, is the zucchini. I'll carefully fold the zucchini in, nice and slow. And once it's incorporated, I'll fold in the chocolate chips. After folding in the chocolate chips, I decided to add some chopped pecans as well. You can add nuts, walnuts, pecans, anything you'd like, but of course, nuts and chocolate chips are optional. Now we'll put the zucchini bread into an oven preheated to 325 for 50 to 60 minutes until a toothpick comes out clean. And here's how the zucchini bread turned out. I really truly appreciate everyone that is subscribed. And if you haven't subscribed, I would love for you to do so and click that bell. And don't forget to hit the like button. I also hope you'll try this recipe and enjoy it as much as we do.